guys, it's Alex, and today I have a thrift haul for you. I haven't done one of these in a while. So, yeah, I have some clothes, which I just put in my bag here, my reusable bag. And then I have some, like, home decor little bits that I'm going to show you. So, why don't we start with the clothes first? So, yeah, let's go ahead and get started. So, the first thing is this top by logo it's Lori Goldstein and you usually see her stuff like on QVC I think it is or HSN one of those shopping network channels but this is um like a long tunic type thing and this was two dollars and 19 cents good condition I thought it would be cozy and comfy and it has pockets on the end this would be great over leggings black leggings because of this black stripe part here so yeah maybe some black riding boots um yeah i think it's cold might have to layer it uh so yeah that's the first thing the next thing is this nice almost brand new sweater uh that i found and let's say, um, let me see what the brand is. I think it's an INC, International Concepts, which I believe you get at Macy's, and this was $1.99. And um, this was 20% off. I went to two different thrifts, three different thrift stores, so I'll tell you like the prices. That first one wasn't a discount. This was 20% off of $2. So. Yeah, and it's like a cowl neck, gold striped and black uh, sweater. Yeah, <laughs> I was going to call it a sweater dress, but it's not a dress. It's just kind of a long sweater, and it has cuffed sleeves. They're sewn up so that they're folded. So that feels really heavy, good quality, keep me warm. So it's a dressy sweater. So two dollars, twenty percent off. Really? I mean, that was like, like almost new. So this was also twenty percent off. This next top, and the tag went flying. This was two ninety nine though. Just set it there, and it it came with the tag. Uh, not the tag, but the buttons. Yeah, so I don't know if this is new or not. But this is by Chris Jenner. Oh, I didn't see that. Chris Jenner collection. I didn't even know she had a collection out. Hmm. I didn't know that. But, <laughs> anyways. Um, I didn't buy it for that reason. I didn't even look at the brand, to be completely honest. I just saw this and thought it would be cute. It has gold studs. And of course I'm gonna have to layer something underneath it because yeah, I don't wanna be flashing anybody. And has nice sleeves. I like how they button at the end. So, very cool. It has a ruffle bottom. Cutie patootie. Next item, this one is brand new. And I hope my battery doesn't run out. This one uh, is from Old Navy. It says oldnavy.com. This was $3.19, no discount. Uh, got this at the Salvation Army. The other one is a local store, the one that has 20% off, so I can't really see where that one's from. But this is just a black pullover sweater short sleeve, cap sleeve type thing. It doesn't really have a sleeve. It's just kind of, yeah, <laughs> sleeveless in a way, but it's brand new, classic black sweater piece. Don't wanna mess up my lighting too, too much. A few more things. I have another top. This one was just from the Salvation Army. This was 319, no discount. This is made by Fashion Bug, and I don't. I wasn't too sure whether or not I should get this because it's kind of 
a lot of floral. Um, the sleeves are sheer, so you can see through those. But then the top has like a black lining tank top underneath it. But I don't know, just the colors are really bright. Just when I'm in that mood to wear something really bright and colorful. I thought I would, so yeah. Got this piece, kind of a dressier top as well. And then I got a pair of jeans. And these are from Torrid. And these were $3.49, no dis discount. It's gonna be kind of hard to show you. But they're just like a medium dark to dark wash. Just a straight leg, pretty much. Um, almost boot cut, but not really. I'm describing this horribly. But yeah, a little bit of distressing on the pockets. Yeah. So got that. Button says Torrid on it. Not that you can see it, but yeah. And then the very last clothing piece I got is a sweater, which is pretty. It's just a white sweater. And this was $5.99, 20% off. Those jeans I got from Salvation Army. I'm kind of going out of order. But um, yeah, this was originally $8.99. They marked it down to $5.99 and then the 20% off. So it's just a white sweater. This one I need like a layering piece under it too because it's kind of thin. I like the sleeves or like a, not lace, but they have a nice pattern to it. It's a pretty white sweat pullover sweater. So that's all the clothing pieces I bought. So let's move on to this bag of stuff that I got that's now rattling around. There's something in there that's rattling, which I'll show you. The first thing I got was this picture. And this is kind of like burlap inside here. And then this, I'm not sure if that's crochet. It kind of looks like it's crocheted flowers. But all of this decor stuff I got at the Goodwill. And this was $1.29. So that's the first thing. The next thing, this is what was rattling around. Um, see if I can show you. It has some rocks. Terranium, is that what they call them? I'm not sure, this was $2.99. I bought it, I'm thinking of redoing the inside of it because it's kind of like a mishmash by now. It has a little bit of moss in there, some twigs. So I kind of want to redo it, but um, yeah. And then you just like hang a string or something and you can hang it from wherever, like in front of a window or yeah, pretty much so. I've seen these, they're very Tumblr-esque looking, but um, you could probably even aloe. I've seen like people put aloe plants in there and you just water it, don't fall. Yeah, I don't think it has a flat base at all, so. If you hear something cr go crashing, you know where it is. I don't know if you saw my last haul that I did. I think it was a thrift haul. Um, I bought one, at, yeah, it would have been a thrift haul because um, I got it at the uh, thrift store. Is the same type of style, but it was a shorter one. And when I had hauled that, I said I saw a taller one, but didn't get it. I just wanted the shorter one. But when I was at the Goodwill, um, totally different store than where I got my other one, I saw this taller wooden candle pillar and figured I would just go ahead and get it because for the second time at a different store, I saw it. So I'm like, you know what? I might as well just get one. Kind of, to kind of go with the other one. So I have like a shorter version of this and now a taller version. Same kind of lines and stuff, real wood. It's nice. Um, and this was this was distributed by Target, so a Target item. This was $3.99. So got that and it'll fit the Bath and Body Works candles. So there's that. Oh, one other thing I got. Like, it's not clothing, but 
um, from the Salvation Army is this poncho rain jacket. I don't know why. I was just thinking I would. This would be good for going to baseball games, but it didn't rain when I went to a baseball game. So, but I just have it now just to keep it handy. This was a dollar. So, yeah. Got that. I never had a poncho before. It's not for style. It's not for looking good. It's just, yeah. It's a men's poncho actually too. So the next thing I got um, is this like beachy themed wall hanging decor. There's a hook to hang it on the wall. This was a dollar ninety nine. I have some other similar pieces like beach themed decor items um, that they keep in a separate like a separate room is designed in like kind of beach type of theme. Um, well, not beach, but like similar pieces to this. But yeah, I thought this was cool. Um, there's a lighthouse and a little fence and a lantern and some rope. So very cute. And then the very last thing, which I didn't know whether to get or not, but I got it. Is a teapot and this was $7.99 so kind of pricey one of the priciest item that I bought um, I don't know like when I bought it I didn't know if I was gonna buy it for use or for decor when you take off the lid it's taped down um, otherwise I would take it all the way off it has rust on it so I'm gonna if I do use it uh, for use not decor I'm gonna do a lead test on it um, you can buy like those lead test strips and test it for lead because I'm not going to be stupid and just use a rusty old teapot. Um, but yeah, it has like this copper handle. Looked rustic to me. I don't know how old it is. Probably, I don't know. I didn't buy it because I thought it was an antique. I just thought it looked cool. Very large. You could brew a lot of hot water in that. So that's the last item I bought that's everything guys so i hope you enjoyed if you like thrift hauls let me know i like doing these thrift hauls um yeah when i get enough stuff i like to show you guys what i get so please give it a thumbs up if you did enjoy and if you'd like to see more videos please subscribe i'm just trying to catch my breath so um i will see you in my next video bye guys Don't you ever